Islands because we all know Colombia is famously hot and we could even be seeing some of those temperatures in the 90 this week. So we're going to turn to your first alert forecast with meteorologist Chandler Jordan now and Chandler. Yeah, we're getting into that really hot mm -hmm. season. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, definitely fitting to have National Heat Safety Week, especially for us closer to home because by the end of the week, high temperatures close to the 90 degree mark. So that's something we'll be keeping an eye out for. And it's actually thanks to two separate areas of low and high pressure helping us out across much of the southeast. So the thunderstorms that brought tornadoes and a lot of damage to families and neighborhoods across the central and southern plains, a lot of strong upper level support with this system, and it's actually helping to bring winds out of our southwest. And then we still got high pressure at the surface just off our shore, clockwise flow bringing in winds from the south and southwest. So this combination of flow is why we're warming up this week and also why we're a little humid out there at times in our afternoons. Now closer to home, there's a couple of upper level clouds out there to get the day started and we've got some patchy fog. So keep that in mind as you head out the door. Bishopville, Sumter, you've got a little bit of fog to deal with this morning. Even around Newberry, Saluda counties, a little bit of fog out there as you get your day started. So it wouldn't hurt to build a little bit of extra time in for your commute this morning. We are a little cool, but that does not last for long because we warm up quickly today by 11 o'clock into the mid 70s. By the afternoon, highs are climbing into the low and mid 80s. So I'd call it a pretty good afternoon to get out to the pool. Just make sure that if you do or if you're spending any type of time outside today, of course, staying hydrated like we just talked about and you'll need some sunglasses, sunscreen and a hat. Of course, our UV index today is a nine, so it won't take long for you to have have some type of impact on your skin without any type of protection. So again, sunglasses, sunscreen and a hat, a necessity today, especially if you're spending extra time outside. Now we continue to warm on up throughout this week as we were talking about mid 80s for your Tuesday and Wednesday. By Thursday and Friday, those look to be the toastiest days of the upcoming week. High temperatures at that point close to 90 degrees. So we'll continue to get a bit of summer like warmth out there across the region by the back half of the week. A week disturbance dropping in for Tuesday and Wednesday for most of us. We're staying dry. Just a little bit of rain with that. I think our better chances of rain are going to be with the slow moving cold front as we get into the upcoming weekend, both Saturday, Sunday and even into parts of next Monday. Showers and thunderstorms can be expected with this system as it rolls through. So these rainfall totals that you see on the map, this is all combined starting today and until next Monday. So we're not going to get an inch of rain all at once, but for certainly many of us out there across the region, I think a half inch to an inch of rain can be expected by this time next week with these rounds of showers and thunderstorms that will pick up for the middle of this week and into the upcoming weekend. So we've got some beneficial rainfall headed our way and it'll help us cool off as well. Not today though, mid 80s, a nice start to our work week. By the late day hours of your Tuesday, we get a few showers as well as a few thunderstorms. Most of us stay dry on Wednesday and then we feel the warmth out there Thursday and Friday. Those are the toastiest of the week. Highs right around the 90 degree mark and then we get into the weekend scattered showers and thunderstorms for your Saturday afternoon with a few of these lingering over into portions of Sunday and even next Monday. We'll be keeping an eye out on a few showers and a few thunderstorms. Make sure you stay with us. Sunrise is back after the break.